asking me for more healthy recipes or things that we can eat that taste very rich and fatty but are actually not. Like my arroscado made with oatmeal. So today I'm going to give you know, another cheat. It's going to be cauliflower crust pizza. Now we know that pizza dough can be a little fattening because it's bread and it's inflammatory in a way, right? So you want to keep it healthy. So I'm going to teach you how to make cauliflower pizza dough. And here we have our cauliflower florets. We have mozzarella cheese and parmesan. We have two eggs. We have oregano, um, salt and pepper and garlic powder. So we are going to mix this and then I'll show you. We have to preheat your oven to 400, like five minutes before you begin or 10 minutes before you begin. And then we will bake this pizza crust for 20 minutes and then we can apply our favorite toppings. Step one, with the florets of the cauliflower, we're going to put it in a blender, like so. Next, we're going to put it in water and going to allow it to boil for about two minutes. You know, I hate eating vegetables. So this is the one way I can cheat and pretend I'm not eating vegetables, but I am. After this, you, you get a net to get out the water, but we still try to drain whatever with a paper towel, whatever is still left behind. So now it's kind of dry. We're going to put in the other ingredients. <laughs> because it already smells so yummy. So you keep mixing it until... You can use a wire whisk if you want to mix the ingredients better. And then you can put it in the center of your parchment paper lined baking sheet. And then we can press it into like a circle. Of course, you can make it as thin or as thick as you want. I kind of like it a little thinner. According to my big bowl swatch, we're going to wait for 20 minutes while it bakes in the oven. Mmm, so good. Yummy, yummy. <laughs> so, while I'm waiting for my cauliflower pizza thing to bake, I'm going to use this Pterodome. As you can see, there are 80 lasers. I had put hair fillers in my hair with the peptides. So I use it for 20 minutes while the pizza is baking. 20 minutes are up. And this is our food. Now, I will put the tomato paste. Oops, hot. <laughs> Spread it. Another 10 minutes or so. 